Hello there, and welcome back to another episode of Hugo House. Today we're going to talk about this rustic New Jersey cabin nestled in a nature park. You'll want to take a look inside this rustic cabin building that is nestled inside a nature park in New Jersey. Since 1985, this 40-acre nonprofit nature park was nestled within the town of Oakland and has charmed visitors attending conferences, wedding receptions. Research expeditions and meditative retreats. Bergen County, New Jersey, is an area that is rich with historic and natural treasures that keep outdoor enthusiasts, families, and historic lovers coming back for more. One hidden trove is the 40-acre nonprofit nature park that is nestled within the town of Oakland, and features some of Mother Nature's finest. Bodicen, which translates to "Wood of Dogs," is owned and managed by Lawrence Levine. Since 1985, the private property and its grounds have charmed plenty of visitors who have attended everything from research expeditions, wedding receptions, conferences, and meditative retreats. At the core of Bois de Chien is its sense of camaraderie and friendship, not unlike the property's Irish pub that was designed to replicate the London landmark that Levine used to visit. The Irish pub was built by tradesmen from Belfast. And is complete with a stained glass shamrock, four beer sprouts, and an Irish hearth. Levine is a Brooklyn native who fell in love with the Lake Champlain region, and his passion inspired the park's latest outdoor venture with this picturesque log cabin building. In 2017, he turned to log chips to help erect his vision. The result is a 1,000 square foot engineered log cabin building that includes a loft, three bunk beds, a barbecue pit. An outdoor entertainment area and a matching log house outhouse. The log cabin building has a wraparound porch that is complete with wrought iron balusters that give contrast against their natural wooden surroundings. You might find yourself feeling inspired for a cabin building retreat of your own, one that you can use with family and friends. Log houses are a popular build that, when done properly, will stand the test of time. There are, however, some things you will want to consider. Once your log house construction is complete, natural enemies such as rain, snow, sun, wind, water, and pests can take away from the beauty of your cabin building. But the good news is that you can help to deter them. Some of the natural enemies of a cabin building can include rain and snow, UV sun rays, and wind, to name a few. Rain and snow. Precipitation is one of the worst enemies of a cabin building, and there are several ways to help prevent the rain and snow from stealing the value of your log house. Cleaning, staining, and sealing your cabin building are a must and need to be done regularly. But some preventive measures can help battle the winter elements. UV rays. The sun's UV rays can also cause cellular damage on the surface of the logs. If these damaged wood cells are not removed, They will eventually become a food source for microfungi. As the fungi growth progresses, the logs in your cabin building will become darker and eventually begin to rot. A solution to this problem is to keep overhangs and porches and trees on both the south and west side of the cabin building. Wind. The wind can accelerate the drying and the cracking of the logs, chinking and caulk. Although air helps to prevent water damage. It can also be a persistent condition in the mountains or desert that hurts the cabin building more than it helps. A good idea is to plant trees on both the south and the west side of the log house. Position the cabin building on the site to avoid windy conditions. Thank you for watching this video, and please do drop a like because it would really help our channel grow. And also, subscribe to our channel. We'll be featuring different houses every single day, from local homes. To tiny homes, to vacation homes, and to other inspiring home ideas.